Hi, my name is Donald Morgan, and I'm going to give you some tips on writing a compare and contrast essay. And I am an English tutor. With compare and contrast essay, there are different techniques or different approaches to how you can um, compile or compare and contrast essay. Depending on your assignment or your preference, you can do just a comparison essay. You can do just contrasting. Or what's most common is both, doing an essay where you're comparing and contrasting. But like I said, it's depending on your assignment and your preference. When you're doing the most common one, which is both, usually you're doing two subjects that you're comparing and contrasting. And the way I usually try to pattern mine is I give at least two paragraphs on the one subject, and two on the other. But you do not have to be limited just as long as you're covering what you need to cover. So two, at least two paragraphs on one subject and two paragraphs on the other, and then you use one paragraph to compare those two subjects and one paragraph to contrast those subjects and then you conclude. So, with the comparison and contrast, you make sure you bring in the information on both subjects, tell how they are alike, tell how they are different, and then conclude. And remember the thesis. You will also go along with whatever your thesis was, and that will need to be restated in your conclusion. Thank you, and I hope it helps.